It's time to review Penetrex Pain Relief Cream. You surely heard of it because it's a really popular pain reliever, but what lies behind its popularity? Because in terms of effect, it's not as good as it seems. So, could Penetrex be a scam? Well, I try to analyze every aspect of this product so that I can give you an honest opinion on it. So here's my review. Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Zolly and I'm bringing you supplement reviews and health guides. So if you want to stay updated with my videos, make sure you subscribe below. This full review is available on my website and you can find a direct link to it in the description. Now, let's take a closer look at Penetrex because this product is really interesting. I'm going to start my review with a really quick summary on it and then I'm going to get to my full analysis. At this point, Penetrex is one of the most popular pain relieving creams, is if not the very most popular. However, that's not enough to make it worth the money. That's because it's mostly a short term remedy, its relief only lasts for a few hours and then the pain returns at the same intensity. For this reason, it's not an actual pain treatment since it doesn't treat the pain or the cause behind it, instead it only hides the symptoms for a short while. In this way, you have to apply this cream several times a day, which makes it really uncomfortable and hard to use. Now, compared to other creams, Penetrex is a pretty decent choice, but compared to supplements which actually treat the pain and the cause behind it, it is definitely not such a good choice. So, considering its price and short-term effect, it's not a product I would recommend any soon, at least not as a top choice and not alone. My top alternatives to Penetrex are surely supplements and my strongly recommended supplement is called Joy Support Plus from Nuzena. It has pretty much the same price as Penetrex but its effect is much stronger because it has a much better formula with more concentrated ingredients and it actually treats the cause of the pain from the inside. So if you're looking for a high quality supplement for about the same price, I definitely recommend this alternative. I'm going to start my full analysis on this product by telling you how exactly it works. And according to its description, it was voted as the best overall muscle rub in 2019. The same description claims that it contains a breakthrough formulation, it has over 8 studies of research behind and it has millions of clients worldwide. Now, I cannot disagree with the claims it makes and if you ask me, Penetrex is better than most pain relieving creams. But it's still a cream so it only works on the outside and this is the reason why I don't consider it an actual pain treatment. It is indeed a short term remedy but it's not an actual treatment. So for me its claims are true but they're not that impressive. As for the company behind it, Penetrex is produced by a brand with the same name which means that it is the only product made by this brand and that it doesn't have any other creams or health supplements. In terms of reputation, this brand has a long history and a positive customer feedback overall, so from this point of view I consider it legit and trustworthy, so you can pretty much buy from it without any worries. Just like most creams, Penetrex doesn't have a very detailed ingredient list and here's what I mean. Its active and inactive ingredients are listed together, there's no main ingredient and there's no dose for any compound. Basically, you can't really tell which is the top ingredient in Penetrex nor its quantity. As I told you, this is something specific for topical products, but even so, Penetrex has a downside at this chapter, if you ask me. Now, I try to separate its active ingredients from the inactive ones, so let's take a closer look at both of them. I'm going to start with the active ingredients. 
basically these are the substances responsible for penetrance effect on pain and even though there are about 10 different active compounds most of them have really low doses this means that many of them don't have any medicinal effect they're only an extra name on the ingredient list but since there are no doses you can't really tell which now out of the 10 active ingredients here are the ones I consider the most important Arnica Montana flower extract this herb has anti-inflammatory properties Sunflower seed oil it mo moisturizes the painful area but not on the inside Aloe vera leaf extract it improves local swelling Boswellia serrata oil it can reduce inflammation on the outside Peppermint oil it provides a cooling and numbing sensation Camphor it has pretty much the same effect as peppermint and tea tree leaf oil it relaxes the painful area and increases blood flow other than this there are two other ingredients worth mentioning I'm talking about MSM and glucosamine both are some of the best ingredients for joint pain and cartilage damage but their effect seems to be much better when used internally as pills that's why I doubt they have any major effect in Penetrex especially since there are no doses either as for the inactive ingredients they are mostly designed to improve consistency, lubrication and smell they don't have any effect for pain or inflammation this is why I won't insist too much on them but you should know that about 50% of Penetrex ingredients are inactive as a conclusion Penetrex doesn't have a bad formula compared to other creams but if you ask me it's not too good either that's because there are no doses or quantities for any ingredients you can't even tell which is its top ingredient and besides this half of the ingredients listed on its label are inactive so in terms of formula it's really not a product that I would recommend at least not alone only if you're associated with a stronger product like a supplement it does work but it's only a short-term remedy so unless you're associated with a stronger product I wouldn't really recommend it here I want to give you more details about Penetrex consistency and how exactly you should apply it now in terms of smell this cream looks pretty good it doesn't have any detectable smell there's only a very light and fresh fragrance but no one can really tell that you're using this cream in terms of consistency it has a white color and a gel like texture which makes it absorb faster than other creams also you should know that it doesn't burn on or sting when it's applied so this is a really big advantage when it comes to dosage just like most creams Penetrix doesn't offer very clear directions the label tells you the method to use when you apply this cream actually you should apply it on the painful spot massage and let it sit in a few minutes it should soak in completely and your pain should get better however there's one thing it doesn't mention how often you should apply this cream since its effect only lasts for a few hours I assume you can apply it as much as you need in order to keep the effect constant still applying it several times per day isn't very comfortable if you ask me and this is one of the reasons why I'm not a big fan of this cream in order to give you an unbiased perspective on Penetrex I decided to analyze its Amazon reviews and surprisingly or not it's one of the most reviewed pain relieving products out there it has an average rating of 4.2 stars out of 5 which is a pretty good number especially since most people used it for minor issues and short term relief now here's what most satisfied users say about Penetrex on Amazon some claim it really keeps the pain under control others say that as long as you apply it several times per day it works a few mention it works for both joint and muscle relief and 30 users swear by it basically I found enough reviews of people who were satisfied with this cream 
but most of them admitted that it's only a short term product and by this I mean that the relief only lasts for a couple of hours. Now I also found enough complaints about it. Some users say the cream doesn't relieve their pain at all, others claim it worked a bit at first but it stopped working afterwards, a few others state it only decreases the pain very little, and I found many complaints saying that it's expensive for the quantity and lastly lots of people claim you have to apply it up to 6 or 7 times a day to maintain the effect. Overall I found more complaints than I actually thought I would. Besides, some users agreed that Penetrex is mostly a secondary product. Since it only works for a few hours, it should be associated with something stronger, like a supplement. This is the main reason why I don't recommend this cream as the main treatment. As a conclusion, Penetrex has mixed reviews on Amazon, but despite the positive ones, I found way more complaints than I actually expected, as I told you before. Most people state that this product isn't an actual remedy since its relief only lasts for a few hours. So considering this, I couldn't possibly recommend Penetrex, at least not as my top choice. As I told you before, if you want to use Penetrex, I strongly recommend combining it with a supplement. It's totally up to you whether you do this or not, but if you want the best effect, I really advise you to do this. From this point of view, Penetrex is a pretty safe product, it doesn't cause any systemic side effects, only local ones at most. The few reviews I found related to its side effects complain about itching, irritation or rashes. Now to tell you honestly, every cream can cause irritation or rashes but the percent is very very low. Actually, less than 1% of people using it suffer from this side effect, so there's still the risk, but it's a really low one. So I personally wouldn't worry too much about this, if Penetrex was really dangerous, it would have way more complaints at this chapter. For the quantity it has, Penetrex isn't necessarily cheap. It's surely not the priciest cream I came across, but if you ask me, it could be a few dollars cheaper. First of all, it comes in several sizes. There's a 2 ounces bottle that costs around $25 normally. Then there's a 4 ounces bottle and it costs around $35 and lastly there's a 3 ounces roll-on that costs about uh, $25 as well. However, since they're all sold on Amazon, you can find often discounts there. Besides, you can find the three sizes combined in different packs. Obviously, the larger the pack, the better the price. But still, for the quantity it contains, Penetrex is a bit pricey. I'm not saying it's expensive compared to other creams, but since its effect only lasts for a few hours, it could be a bit cheaper. Now, I won't compare Penetrex with another cream because as I told you, creams aren't a proper treatment for joint pain. Instead, I will compare it with my top recommended joint pain product. I'm talking about a supplement from Nuzena called Joint Support Plus. So Penetrex has a local effect that lasts a few hours at most. And on the other hand, Nuzena's supplement has a durable effect that doesn't go away even if you quit the pills after a while. Penetrex costs between $25 and $35 per bottle depending on the size you choose and Nuzena's supplement costs $30 per bottle and it is a monthly supply. Now you have to know that you can use a coupon code that I offer and in this way you will get uh, $10 uh, dollars off for any bottle so uh, the final price is going to be about $20 per bottle and if you buy a larger pack you can get this supplement for about $15 per bottle as for Penetrex, it also has uh, some discounts and some lower prices, but 
they're not constant and you have to check the product out on Amazon to see if its price decreased or not. Now out of these two, I would strongly recommend going for Nuzena's product. That's because it is the best supplement when it comes to joint pain. But if you really want to use Penetrex, you can associate it with Nuzena supplement until the supplement starts working because it takes a while. You can use Penetrex to keep your pain under control. As a conclusion, my opinion on Penetrex is that it is a bit priced for its actual value. This is why I don't recommend it, at least not alone. If you really want a quality product, I would surely go for Nuzena supplement, especially since it has a much better effect. Now, you can surely use Penetrex, but I strongly recommend combining it with a supplement, which has a much better effect. Plus that Penetrex is a cream and Nuzena's product is a supplement, so they work through different mechanisms. But when it comes to using Penetrex alone, I wouldn't really suggest you to do that. Here's how I would sum up my opinion on Penetrex in three ideas. First of all, it has a local and short effect, and this is actually the best way to summarize its potency. Since it only works on the outside, the cause behind your pain isn't treated at all. And this is the reason why the pain returns as strong as before once the numbing effect disappears. Secondly, it may or may not work. It actually has a bunch of mixed reviews on Amazon. Some people say it's excellent, while others say it, did, it didn't have any effect for them. So you should keep this in mind before buying this product. And lastly, I personally think it is a bit pricey for its actual value. It doesn't come in a really high quality and its effect doesn't last a lot. So it's not a proper joint treatment. It's true that it's a good relieving solution for the short term, but precisely for this reason, it should be a bit cheaper. So is Penetrex worth it or not? Well, my answer is yes and no, depending on the case. Normally, it's not one of the products I would recommend considering its low potency and short-term effect. So it's not a real uh, joint pain treatment and this is a main reason why I couldn't possibly recommend it. The only situation where I would recommend Penetrex is if it's associated with a supplement. That's because supplements are a proper joint pain treatment. They work from the inside, so their effect is much better in terms of intensity, strength and long term. Plus that supplements have a much better price for the quantity and quality. Their only downside is that they usually need a few weeks or at least 2 or 3 months to start working, so the effect appears a bit more slowly. So if you need a fast relief in the meantime, Penetrix can really help. But keep in mind that this cream doesn't have a long-term effect, so you have to continue, continue to using it if you want a constant effect. And this is the reason why I don't recommend it as a main joint pain treatment. That was my full analysis on Penetrex. I really hope you enjoy watching this review and that it helped you understand how this product works and why exactly it is good and why exactly it is not good. So in case you have any questions or any personal experiences you want to share about this cream, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching this review and make sure you subscribe if you want to stay updated. So see you next time in my next video.